So here we are on a snowy Sunday afternoon and thinking about the calling class we have coming up. And so yes. wanted to do an introduction here and bring people's attention to this class. And it'll be starting on March 22nd, it'll be a Tuesday evening. And this is a, a calling group for couples. Yeah. And we're excited. Yep. Couples. Yeah, we're couples. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And we're doing pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, I don't know. No. <laughs> so one of the things uh, that uh, we've had about, boy, at this point, it's almost 40 people that have gone through this yes. class with us. And, and what the calling is, it's a transformational coaching program. And what that means is that we're taking a look or maybe a, how would we introduce that? It's like it's it's a coaching program. Yep. So the language is coaching. It's a yep. faith based program yep. or a mm -hmm. workshop. We like to call it a workshop. Right. And it's experiential. It's different than just a typical Bible study. And because, as Gretchen has said, experiential in that you're engaged in the process. So what the calling is, is it really is helping people take a look at what in their life they're dissatisfied with. We uh, see couples that are in a place of wanting something different, something more, or, or there's something a together. shift yep. in their in their history. They're mm -hmm. empty nesters. Right. They're facing retirement. They want to start a business. Yep. They want to adopt a child. So there's there's either a shift and many options, and yep. don't know which to take, mm -hmm. or it's discovering something that ugh, yep. let's just go. Yeah. I want to. I want something. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and so the the scripture says that without vision, the people perish. Or another translation says, without vision, the people become unhindered. And so oftentimes we have these longings in our life. Mm -hmm. We're dissatisfied about something, but we but just we're on this hamster wheel. Yeah, it's just kind of you, you know? accept it the way yeah. it is, and nothing changes. You tell yourself that yeah. you settle mm -hmm. um, at your gut level. You know it could be more, should be, could more. be more. You want more. You want more. Yeah. Um, and here's the thing is I think, and, and God wants us to be engaged in our yes, giftings and he wants giftings. us to be engaged in a way that impacts the kingdom. Yep. And that could be through a business. It could be through, um, you know, some ministry. areas of service ministry. And so the, the calling here again, the, the, just a the general process is declaring a vision. And then we take a look at the ways in which, uh, you're thinking. And this is a discovery process. Mm -hmm. You're identifying those ways in which you have limited yourself, those ways in which you have trapped yourself in a box, perhaps. Habits. Habits. That's a, that's a big one. And, uh, and, and it provides a track to run on and a process to help you move towards the vision. So it's uncovering what the vision is. And I am convinced God has a vision for each one of yes. us. Yes. Right? We've never had anyone in the class not find a vision. Not find a vision. And it's. Always amazing. It's, yeah. it's a beautiful process. Yeah. It it's a great I mean, we have so much fun. We laugh yeah. and Yeah, we laugh. And uh, and you know, there are some stuck points <laughs> and uh, Well I think that in you know, one of the chapters, um, as you're uncovering these things that are hindering you and walking in the vision, right? That's where that's where resistance begins right, to come up. And right. that that's all about Look, you don't make major changes in your life unless you press through the resistance. We know that. Mm -hmm. I know that. And yeah. so you have to press through the resistance. So that's uncovering it. It comes up. But it's a process. God will meet you in it. You'll be in a community of support. Um, we have seen amazing things happen. We've seen uh, pastors reawaken their calling for their pastorate. We've seen pastors, wives and pastor, the husband and wife coming together and just mm -hmm. getting on the same page again about ministry. And we've seen business people use this. We've seen ministries start as a yep. result of ministry this. Ministry start, business yep. start. We've seen couples that are in these transition years moving into serving together and excited yep. about that. Yep. Uh, it is to take a couple and like think they're on different pages. Mm -hmm. And by the end of the calling, they're on the same page because it really unearths yeah. the, the, the like pieces mm -hmm. and then it knits them together even stronger. Yeah, well, it's like the idea of pulling, they're, they're no longer unequally yoked, they're yoked together as God yeah. has designed marriage and then they're pulling together to what uh, what they want to have and happen that, in And that lives. piece that brought you together, that God brought you together and there's, there's, there's a knitting there for something, mm -hmm. but sometimes different tracks 
kids with a disability or kids that are difficult or yep. or no kids and you want kids or whatever and some so the, the, the couple can pull apart and like I said this is this is not marriage counseling for sure right. mm -hmm. but but it brings you back to that connectedness of of moving forward together which yeah. truly everyone wants in the oneness that yeah. God has designed sure, sure. And I think that's what's so exciting about it. Mm -hmm. And so we look forward. We, uh, yeah. we look forward to having you sign up. You can go to our website and read more about it. Please consider it. Sure, sure. It's skin in the game. Yep, skin and in the game. And it does. And look, the, 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 the fact of the matter is it is an investment. And when we use the word investment, we really mean that because investment means that what you're putting into it is going to grow. And so uh, the opportunity for the for you as a couple to grow, the opportunity perhaps for business to grow, for ministry to increase, what's that worth to you? Mm. you know? So um, we really are excited mm -hmm. to offer it again. Yep. And it gets better and better each time. <laughs> yeah, <it laughs> we get better at presenting and, yeah. and God just really um, blesses it. And yeah. uh, So please join us. Yep. We will have some more videos as we're getting closer to the date and encouraging people to sign up. So again, you can go to the website. You can give us a call. There should be a link somewhere mm -hmm. in the video or under it or yep. nearby or floating through it. Yeah, I don't know how you all do <laughs> I it. don't it's know. Like people point this way and this way, but it's, yeah. But I'll figure it out. Greg, she's the creative director. I just show yeah, up. I'm just a smiling face. <laughs> but we're excited to have that. So please come and join us. We'll have fun. We'll see what God's going to do in your life. Yeah. All right, here we go. Bless you.